Hello friends. I'm waiting for you guys to pop on. It's uh, 10 o'clock in California and today we are talking about Chinese New Year. So um, I'll just wait for a few of you to get on and then we will get going. So um, I just posted on PopeyeIdeas.com and we're going to put a link in the comments right now and I'll pin it up to the top. So all of the um, Popeye ideas that we talk about today are going to be listed on um, Popeye ideas under the Chinese New Year post. And in that post, um, there's links where you can just point and click. I found the most inexpensive place to buy um, the items that we'll talk about. And so instead of using your valuable time running around to lots of different stores trying to gather up enough Popeyes to do, um, I typically just order all of my Popeyes online and it's really easy to point, click, have it shipped to your house and um, then you're ready to tackle your next month of Popeyes. So, um, so Chinese New Year, I, um, I grew up in the Bay Area and I live next door to a family that came from China and every year I kind of delighted in getting a little gift um, from our neighbors. So in the Chinese culture, um, typically unmarried um, people get a little uh, red envelope and there's sometimes a lot of money, but sometimes just a couple of coins and it's just a symbol of good luck in the new year. So um, these you can get on Amazon or if you have any sort of um, Asian grocery stores nearby. They're adorable. You can give these out to your clients' kids individually and put their name on the back. Um, I am, um, I, I've done this a lot of different ways before. So if you are in California, um, they actually produce a lotto ticket every year, which is um, for Chinese New Year, and this is the year of the dog. So you can um, you know, just slip the lotto ticket inside or you can put a couple of coins inside. There's also just some novelty scratchers that you can put inside the envelope um, and they will just, when you scratch off the fortune, um, it will just say like a little, a little greeting. And I linked that onto the post as well. Or you can just get any lotto ticket or um, a $2 bill, something you know unusual or maybe get um, a one a one dollar coin something like that so these um, come in a lot of different designs they're adorable they have ones that I linked that have dogs on them for the year of the dog um, don't feel like you um, you know have to do anything huge inside here uh, lotto tickets are very popular they're a dollar and that's a great easy idea probably one of the most inexpensive ideas is on Amazon you can buy 350 fortune cookies for around $20. I went to our local Asian market and you know just for 50 of them I think I paid like $8 so it's definitely cheaper to buy online. These are really cute if you put them in one of those white takeout containers and so you could probably put fit in a 16 ounce one maybe 15 of them and then I created a label for you and I posted it on Popeye Ideas, and here it is. It's in reverse, um, <laughs> but it says, I'm so lucky to have you as a client. Do you guys like it when I make labels for you and make it easy? Okay, so um, you can print this on one sticky label, put it on the top of the fortune cookie box, um, or you can you know, just cut it out on white paper and tape it that way. Um, I tend to like the one sheet sticky labels because they're you know they stay put really nice so that is an idea fill a container with um, fortune cookies with the the tag on top another good idea is um, they have these almond cookies and I put a link to them um, those are a nice um, treat if, if you like them I like them um, and they run between like five dollars a box so around the cost of Girl Scout cookies you could probably break this down and put them in a um, Chinese takeout container that I've linked on Amazon where you can buy those um, Chinese containers those little white boxes are perfect to use year-round too you can um, put a lot of different Popeyes so I'll usually order like a 50 pack and then I'll use them to put 
um, different gift cards and different pop by gifts. And since it is the year of the dog, I wanted to show you, you could give your clients a puppy. Wouldn't that be cute? All of your clients get a puppy. You get a puppy, you get a puppy, you get a puppy. Anyways, so people love it, love when you dote on their children and their dogs. There's over 300 million dogs in the United States and people are pretty crazy over dogs. So since this is the year of the dog, um, I thought you could drop off one of those white um, Chinese takeout containers filled with milk bones, or you can just buy a bag of dog treats. Do you like these? <gasps> Do you like these? Um, celebrating the year of the dog. So as always, I'm never too busy for any of your Sacramento referrals. Um, and uh, also, if you have any Popeye questions, you can post them below and I will get back to you um, answering them. So, happy Chinese New Year. I had a client, um, here I'll give this back. I had a, um, a um, agent in the Bay Area who asked me um, what, you know, who told me that she was Chinese and that she always gave um, Chinese New Year gifts out to just her Chinese clients. And I think you should give them to everyone because part of what's great about America is we love different cultures and we love celebrating different cultures and different traditions. So if you are Chinese, please give them to all of your clients, um, just like you know St. Patrick's Day or you know other holidays um, that are culturally significant. Because I would love um, to, you know, as I did as a child, getting little gifts from my neighbors for Chinese New Year. So anyways, thank you so much for tuning in and um, the link to where you can click and buy your Popeyes. We're going to be talking um, later in the week and I'll post. I am going to do a full list of what to do for Super Bowl. So um, I hope you can tune in and as always, never too busy for any of your Sacramento real estate referrals and keep popping by.